When it comes to picking out Christmas presents, I think you'd agree that there are some people that are just impossible to buy for. Usually it's the dad in the family. Most dads are difficult to buy for because, well, they just seem to have everything they might need or want. If dad works on special projects, he seems to already have all the tools he needs. If he loves to work in the yard, his garage is already full of mowers, and trimmers, and chainsaws. What about clothes? Well, if he needs a shirt, he's already bought it. Same with suits and shoes. What kind of gift do you get for someone who seems to have everything? Here's another question. What kind of gift do you give to the person who has nothing? With so much need, that gift would have to be pretty special. It was that challenge that faced our Heavenly Father when he looked down on the people in this world. We and every other person who's ever lived were people who had nothing. Nothing at all when it came to our ability to please God. Nothing at all in a relationship with God because of our own sin. Nothing at all when it came to hope for the future, joy in the presence, peace in our lives. But in his love and wisdom, God came with the perfect gift for people like us who had nothing. It was the gift of his son. In that gift, God found a way to mend our broken relationship with him. In that gift, he found a way to give us perfection in his eyes that we simply couldn't achieve for ourselves. In that gift, he was able to give us perfect peace, perfect joy, and a sure hope for a future that will stretch into all eternity. This Christmas, you and your family will gather again, first in church and then in your home, to celebrate this perfect gift for people who have nothing. You won't celebrate the way the world celebrates this holiday as it centers on material things and passing emotions. You'll celebrate with humble and heartfelt thanks because you who had nothing now have a Savior who has brought you everything you'll ever need. Have a blessed Christmas and a joyful New Year.